Ladies and gentlemen, great Americans, thank you. Thank you so much. You know, it's wonderful to be here, and we're going to talk about something today, something tremendous, really incredible. We're here to talk about a guy, a friend, a fantastic guy, Ice Twice. Twice. Ice. Twice. That's right, they call him Ice Twice. And let me tell you, the story behind it is something you're going to love. I think you're going to love it. It's big, folks, really big. Now, some people ask, why do they call him Ice Twice? Donald, what's the deal with that? And it's an amazing story, believe me. You see, the first time he iced, everyone was blown away, totally blown away. No one saw it coming, nobody. And he did it perfectly, folks. The first time he iced, it was flawless. He was smooth, he was strong, he was unstoppable. People said, wow, that's the greatest icing we've ever seen. And I'm telling you, they've seen a lot of icing, but this was legendary. Now, normal people, just regular people, they ice once and they think that's enough, but not ice twice. No way. He said one time, that's not enough. I can do better. So he iced again. That's why they call him ice twice. Nobody ices twice. You've got people who are out there icing once doing, okay, but this guy iced twice. And the second time, even better than the first, stronger, faster, a real winner, folks, a total winner, folks, a total winner. And that's what America is about, isn't it? We're not satisfied with just, okay, we're the best. We go for the top. We ice twice. And of course, you've got the liberals out there, folks. You always do, right? They're always around. They said, oh, you shouldn't ice twice. You can't do it. It's too much. But what happened? He proved them wrong. He proved them wrong like we've done so many times. We're going to keep proving them wrong just like Ice twice did. And now they're the ones melting away, believe me.